Alright, so in today's video, we're going to be doing a game. It's all based on if Erica can guess the right fish. You guys will win more prizes out of these mystery tackle boxes. So it's all up to Erica. So hopefully, she can guess these fish. Now, I did do it a little bit fair. I put some fish. I don't think she will know. I put some fish. I do think she will know. It's half and half. So hopefully, she knows these fish. And as you can see, the green screen behind me, yes, there's a green screen behind me, is going to be how I'm going to show you guys the fish. I don't just have to pop them up on the screen. Instead, they'll just be right behind us. As you can see from below, my channel name has changed from Crooked Smile Fishing to just CR Hook. It stands for Cody's Really Hooked on, because I'm really hooked on fishing, guys. So I'm going to scroll on my iPad, and you guys will get to see exactly what we're seeing. But first thing is first, let's open the mystery tackle box. So I'll let her open the first one. Oh, show them or dump them? Uh, you can just show them. You can dump them. They got some of these. Well, it's got some kind of gel inside. It does. It's got some kind of liquid salt series gel. So I'm guessing there's some scented stuff in there. So you've got some white and gray paddle tails first thing out the box. Another set of sparkly white and gray. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> sparkly white and gray paddle tails, guys. So we got a gold spoon. Looks like something. This is a gold spoon. This is actually new from Shop Carl's. This is the salty spoon. And I showed you guys in one of my last giveaways that it looks like it's a sand flea because it has these little ridges. And maybe that helps it cast further. Maybe that helps it get a better bite. But keep going. You gotta go fast through this. Uh, some kind of gray minnow. Mad minnows, guys. These are Shop Carl's other lures that are really cool. I showed you before. A glittery minnow. You got a savage gear. <laughs> savage gear. Twitch reaper. Or glittery minnow, as she called it. Some hooks. Uh, size four. Yeah. Got some size four big gun circle hooks. Oh, this really cool sticker. That's one box down. All right, now I'll open a box and then she'll open the next box. So, in this one, we got. It looks like a top water popper. The Arc TS 115. It looks angry. It does look angry. <laughs> But it looks cool, so we're going to set that there. We have, oof, these are really good, guys. I, I've thrown these before. I like the fact that they give you this little spot to put an extra treble hook right there. This is the Live Target Mullet. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Next, we got a Matrix Mullet. What would you call these? Oh, pink worms? I don't know. <laughs> we, got, we got brown eye lures, pink worms. <laughs> no, they're, they're, even... they're brown eye lures, sea devils. Oh. Or devil eyes, maybe. Those are devil eyes. So they're the brown eye lure devil How eyes. How do you hook them? How do you hook them? Just like a paddle tail. Oh. It just has a different tail. And next, we got some belly weighted hooks, size four. We got some golden eye dock side jig heads. Always, always needed. And they love to give you guys white paddle tails, as you've seen from a lot of mystery tackle boxes, because white paddle tails are so universal, and, and they basically catch fish everywhere. And then you got a sticker in here. You got a... Oh, that was cute. A license to reel. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. That's pretty that cool. That was cute. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Got another live target thing. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Does it have a hook in it? Uh, yeah, it's the hidden hook right there, see it? Oh. So you got a live target shiner. This thing is big, guys. Five and a half inch bait. This is a big bait. Um, I don't know what that is. It's got a hook and a spinner on it. Now this is 10,000 fish. This is a brand that Shop Carl's actually makes themselves. And it is the underspin. And it's got a cool yellow and white look to it with a little shiny spoon underneath it. This thing would be awesome for big paddle tails offshore. All right. Boom! More white paddle tails. More white paddle tails, guys. Some little green minnows. Look how cute those are. Yeah. Well, they're scented, too. So this is called Euro Tackle Finesse. These are some small scented minnows. They do look cool. The little ridges on them look pretty dope. And then you got this little thing. Looks real good. I don't you know, know what this, it is. But you know what it is? Um, oh, they have a mouth like that. Is it the bass piece? It, it, most of the time, they're poppers. So see it's a oh, yeah. So it just sits across, pops in the water. It, the most time you do throw these for bass. So we have a Mach K Popper 70. So pr pretty cool looking lure right there as well. We got some size 2 hooks. <laughs> and hold on. Oh, the snake, eel, American <laughs> horn. 
Yeah, I wouldn't do it, guess either. Another sticker. All right. And you got the Dibble magazine. All right. So first thing in the box, you have some Savage Gear white paddle tails. Great, great lures. They do like the white paddle tail. Not gonna lie. It's six in here already. <laughs> All right. You got some Salt Native Beast Walker. Now this is a top water. You just walk it across, dog walk it, find good top water bites. You have a Weston top water. Now that one looks really cool. That one does. It's got like a spinny thing on the back. It does. It has a little spinny piece on the back. I'll, sh I'll make sure I zoom in on this. It's called the Spot On Twin Turbo. This may be a plopper. It might plop, blah, 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 you know. Yeah, I remember. All right. You have a pack of not white, but <laughs> green and black paddle tails. Also, green and black paddle tails come in clutch in that dirtier, darker water. They can see it a little better for them. Set that there. You have a catch code sticker. And another belly weighted hooks, guys. This is a size, want to guess? No, that's not. <laughs> it's not size four. It doesn't say. All right, so that's empty. We're going to set that one down. And Erica, oop, it fell forward. Erica is going to do the last mystery packer box. And then we'll talk about the game. Oh, okay, okay. So what's what we got? Let's see the money. We got some heavy, clear green thing. So this is a sinking twitch bait. And it is big. This thing would be a tank for offshore. Look at that thing. It looks awesome. So JC Lee just sinks and you twitch it while it goes down. Alright, I'm gonna do it like him. Alright, so this is a a Bausta um top water. You just do it like this. <laughs> That's it right there. And it that's a big bill on it, you can see. So it actually does swim, like she said, when you reel it in. This would be probably pretty good for trolling. And then some size three hooks. Ooh, some shrimps. Always needed some shrimps. Oh, and if you couldn't guess, some more white paddle tails. As you can see, they're a trend here. But what do you need for white paddle tails? Your jig heads. Jig heads, good job. I'm proud of you actually knowing that. These are actually screw lock jig heads. Pretty, pretty official. Is that all of it? Yeah. All right, so that is all the stuff. We're going to lay all this off the table, get a nice close-up for you guys, and then we'll be right back to tell you about the game. stuff at home so hopefully she knows her fish and I'll tell you right now she is not the most experienced angler she gets out there with me on occasions when you know it's it, warm it's warm she does not do pro fishing so we're gonna set the prize bag right here every fish that she can pick out I'm gonna let her pick a prize out and that's gonna be part of the giveaway now I'll announce all the giveaway stuff at the end of the video so stay tuned for that but let's go with the first fish all right first fish babe I'll show you guys so she's seeing the same thing that is behind us. So what is this? A ladyfish. A ladyfish. That is correct. All right. Do so I pull now. So you want to pull now? Yeah. We can do that. All yeah. right. So first prize. Find something big. Something good for him. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Don't just pull those white paddle tails. <laughs> I like white paddle tails, honestly. All oh. right. So your first thing you picked out. What do we got? The little spinner and hook thing. So she picked out a ten thousand fish underspin. Now, like I said, this is a really good bait for all kinds. It's basically a jig head with an underspin. So that's your first thing. All right. One fish down. Let's see if she knows what this fish is. Show you guys just so you know she's seeing the same thing. Mahi. Or? A dolphin fish. Oh, she knows both yeah. things. We're going to give her two prizes because she knew both names. And I'm feeling generous. I want you guys to get a bunch of stuff at home. So, you got some shrimp. Find them big old freaking. Nope. Yeah, there you go. All right, so we have a salt native beast walker. This is a four inch top water lure. She's hooking it up so far. What is this fish? Oh no. Uh... What would you call this fish? Oh, a pig. That's like a. Do you call it a pig? Yeah. It just doesn't look. I don't know, it's like a monster. I have no idea. 
It's fairly close. Okay, so I'm not going to give her this one, guys. I have to play fair. She didn't know what this is. It's a hogfish. Oh, close, close. It was close. You were very close. All right. <laughs> so she didn't know what a hogfish is. Sorry. And if you didn't know what it was at home, now you do. So next fish we're going to go through is we got, what is that? Oh, a look down. She got it right again, guys. I didn't think she knew what a look down was. I'm not going to lie, but apparently she does. We talked about it that one time. That's a reason. It's a Oh, yeah, we, just, we did catch one. We have caught one with her on the channel before. That's how she knows what it is. Hold on, I'm not trying to get any of those. Uh... Oh, got them anyways. <laughs> Dang. Dang. Hey, these are actually good, though, because you get three white paddle tails. All right, so the next, next fish is this. Now, I'm only going to show her the bottom. You don't have to know the top, because the bottom one's kind of hard. What is that? Mm, bass. What well, kind of bass? You have to have the right bass, or I'm not giving it to you. It's a very distinct bass, and they're only in a certain spot, but... Three-striped bass. A three-striped bass. What do you guys think? Is that a three-striped bass? <laughs> is it called a three-striped bass? Is that? No, it's not a three... <laughs> <laughs> it's a peacock bass. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so she didn't know what a peacock bass, which, on her behalf, we've never been to South Florida together and actually went down there and caught them, so I understand her not knowing. Do you know what this fish is? Hold on. Um... Mangrove. Yeah? All we right. need that. What, what is it? A type of what? Snapper. All right. Yeah. Okay, she got that one, guys, so we'll let her. Pull out the gold spoon. All right, so, so far you got one, two, three, four, five products, and we've only made it through a few fish. Next fish we have on the board. Actually, there's two fish in this one. So, you have a chance to win two things. Can you tell us what that is? I'll show you guys, so you know she's seeing the same thing we're seeing. Um, what is that one? Well, I mean, I know that they, it's either a kingfish or like something else. Um, What's another name for a kingfish? What happened to my Which one's a kingfish? So you can get, at least if she can get the kingfish right, you guys get one of the prizes. So which one would be the kingfish? The big one. The big one is a kingfish. So that's okay. one prize. Now you think about it while you're picking this prize, what that other fish would be called. It's What is the other name for a kingfish? A king? It's not a mackerel. That's not it. It's a mackerel. Got you some, uh... Got you a pack of hooks. Always form. needed. Always needed. Hooks are always needed. I don't know. Um... Come on, you gotta get them some more prizes. Come on, it's up to you. I know, I know it's up to me. I have no idea. Sorry, guys. She got, the king, she got the king mackerel, though. All right, you gotta know this one. What is this one? It's a clownfish. All right. Yeah. It's okay. Nemo. All right. We'll give her two because she uh she knew why I put it on here. Everyone should know why it's on here. So, go ahead and grab two more prizes. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm getting another set. So you've got the white paddle tails. These look good as well. Hold on, I have to dig around in here. Hard. Oh, got you some green paddle tails. Got you some green paddle tails. All right. All right, so the next fish on our list is this. All right, so what is this, babe? Oh, pompano. Good food, man. That is good food. All right, here we go. Got you that thing. All right, so she got you the top water popper right there. Okay. Next fish, me. I'm feeling hot. <laughs> All right, so the <laughs> next fish, what is this? Uh, a marlin? Yeah. That's a marlin? Yeah. Is that your final answer? Yes. For a million dollars, you're going with the answer marlin. Yes. So that's your final answer? Yes. Not valid. <laughs> is it a swordfish? It's not a swordfish either, guys. Not valid. One more guess. You've guessed a marlin um, and a swordfish. Dang. You give up. It swims really fast, yeah? It does swim okay. very fast. It is a sailfish. Dang it, it, man. Now, you can tell it's a sailfish because you see the sail on its back. Now, a swordfish just has a regular dorsal fin, while a sailfish has this whole sail. That's why it's called a sailfish. Mm. So, next fish. 
Amberjack. How did you know so fast? She she got it before I could even show you guys. All right, well that's an Amberjack. Oh, do you? I'm fine. You're really late. Oh no, you're good. Just keep running the video. Go ahead and pick them all something out. All right, so she got you. Now what is this called? Do you remember what I called it? A plopper. A popper. Popper. It popper. is a popper. Yeah. So some of this stuff is sticking. This is also good for her. She can learn fishing information. Do you know what this is? A piranha. I have no idea. A piranha. That's what it looks like. It does kind of look like a piranha in that picture. Is it not a piranha? Is that what you found, guess? Piranha. In. It is a permit. It's not a pompano. You see how it looks like a pompano, but it's darker? Mm -hmm. We get both of these in the area. All right, so the next fish. Oh, man. Um, what would you call this? What does it look like? Uh, it looks like that um, chicken from Surf's Up, though. <laughs> um, I have no idea. It looks mean. It does look mean. Kind of looks like an amberjack with like her hairdo, huh? Yeah. So what's I have your no final idea. answer? What would you name this fish if you could name this fish? Mm. Jason with great hair. Jason with <laughs> great hair. Okay. <laughs> Well, this is a rooster fish. Oh, I definitely see that. I definitely There's a rooster see it. fish. Okay. okay, so next fish. A lionfish. I'm not lying. What kind of fish is it? A lionfish. <laughs> it be okay. lying around. It does be lying around. Okay, so she got the lionfish, guys. I didn't know if you'd know that one or not. It's an invasive species. She knows that. Hold on, let me get something good in here. Another nice lure. So this is. Is it squishy? Oh, it's squishy. I thought it was a hard plastic. So this is a this is that twitcher bait, and I thought it was a hard plastic, but it's actually a soft plastic. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Okay, next fish. What is that? Hmm. I don't know. What would you call this fish? Oh, one of those half and half cookies from Publix. A half and half cookie from Publix. Yeah. So that's what his name is, half and half? Half and half cookie, yes. Not valid, guys. This is a cobia. Oh, dang. <laughs> yes. Really good eating. I thought they were more blue. They do pop. Mm, yeah, a little bit, but this is a kind of, I could have given you no. more pictures, I guess. I could have done that. All right, next fish. I have no idea. No idea. What would you call this fish? Um... I don't know. He's like a, he's like a, like a redfish and like a, he's like a snapper and like a bass. A snap bass. A snap bass. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not a snap bass. Is that your final answer? Yeah, that's what I'm putting that one in. Sorry, it's snap bass. Okay, it is a black sea bass. Oh, I was close. But okay. you were close. It's basically a redfish mixed with a bass. Nice. All right, next. A blue fish. Well, gave it away. Is that not, is that what it is? Yeah. Oh, okay, nice. All right. Mix this thing up here. How big do they get? Oh, they can get pretty big. In our area, they don't get as big as they usually do because we don't have the cooler water like they like. Oh, you guys got the white and silver paddle tails with the smelly gel. Okay. Nice, nice. All right, next fish. Sword fish, yeah. Swordfish? Swordfish. That's your final answer, not Marlon? I don't know now. Yes. Swordfish. Swordfish. It's a swordfish. All right. All right. <laughs> you made me question it because the other one was wrong. <laughs> they got the purple top water, yeah? So you got a matrix. Yeah, this is a top water popper as well, a purple one. So, so far, hooking it up. Okay, this is a decent test. Do you know what this is? Oh, Goliath River. Buddy. Okay, apparently she knew more than half the fish in this challenge. Because I thought she didn't know them all, but I guess she did. You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh. Got this gray and white minnow. Salt made of mad minnow. Great lure. Catches all kinds of fish, freshwater and saltwater. There's one more fish that I'm going to do, and I saved my favorite fish for last. This is a fish I catch on the channel all the time. She can't see that right now, but there's a video of me catching one playing. So, what is this fish? 
A red fish. Or? A red drum. It also is a red drum. So go ahead and pick out one more thing. Right on. Let me get in here. All right, that is the last one, guys. I'm doing the giveaway. So a brown lures. These are the devil eyes. So this is what you can win. How many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So she got fourteen prizes for you guys at home. You're welcome. You're welcome. Let's give it a hand for, for Erica catching you guys a bunch of lures that catch you guys a bunch of fish. Now, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to click that like button. So to enter this giveaway, the thing you have to do is you have to go below and you have to comment your bucket list fish. Whatever fish you want to catch the most in your life, that will enter you to win this giveaway. I will go live at 20,000 subscribers, which I'm about 4,000 away, and pick a winner for this giveaway. Now, when I do reach the 20,000 subscriber mark, I think I'm going to do about two to three giveaways, and this is just going to be one of them. So keep an eye out for other giveaways. If you guys enjoyed Erica being on the episode, let me know in the comment section. Until next time, guys, peace.